In the mountains of western North Carolina, there's a company called Misty Mountain. We have a compelling story. It's all made in the USA. Misty Mountain makes specialty climbing equipment. We feel like we make the best climbing harnesses in the world. They're comfortable, they're lightweight, they're durable, they work the way you want them to. In the climbing harness business, quality control is paramount. As a company based in the U.S., we tend to overbuild uh, our gear beyond the standards that's required. They often put the straps and seams they've sewn to the test. That was 5,250 pounds is what we broke that at. It's not just about the force required to break the strap, but where it's separated. Here, it was the webbing, not at the seam. This is best case scenario. Misty Mountain is always striving to make its products stronger, better, safer. We don't go into design and marketing meetings trying to figure out how to cut costs. In the past several years, the company has made harnesses for the military. We want to do everything we can as a company to make sure that they have a chance to do their job safely and come back. On this day, the harnesses were being made for the Australian Special Forces. By virtue of our special forces co-training with other special forces from NATO countries, we have other opportunities now. Misty Mountain being situated where it is works on a couple of levels. This area, as much as any in North Carolina and maybe more than some, uh, you know, was devastated when textile mills and, and jobs moved away. The 23 employees are a mix of climbing enthusiasts who know the needs and sewing experts who can provide the necessary quality. It's like one plus one equals three almost. It's a very synergistic effect. The location works too because nearby there are so many places to climb. We're always inspired to design better gear because we're always out using the gear. The company benefits from new interests in zip lines, climbing gyms, and more people hitting routes outside. We're big believers in climbing and anything that we can do to help people facilitate getting out and climbing, we want to do. Even at that, Misty Mountain is still a relatively small company. Our growth potential is even higher than the industry as a whole, I think. I'm Richard Green, and this is Made in the Carolinas.